All right, so we're going to review the V-split. So the V-split is something that we're going to utilize when deploying the Minuteman um, when we have a short frontage on a building. So we're going to utilize the chute building to display this. How this differs from the forward accordion load is we're actually going to go to our drop point, so maybe to the door or wherever we're going to charge our line, and we're going to stretch the hose back from there. This allows you to get all 100 feet of that bundle in a very small section, about a 10 to 15 foot section. This also works out really well in apartment buildings. So Bobby's going to walk up with the um, hose intact on his shoulder, the 100 feet of Minuteman. He's going to go up to the front door or his drop point. We're gonna do it at the bottom of the stairs here. So now how this differs from the forward accordion at this point is instead of just grabbing one loop in the nozzle, his pistol hand, which is his left hand here, is gonna grab half of the stack. And then his right hand or his left hand is gonna grab the other half of the stack. So rather than just grabbing one loop, he's gonna grab half and half. He's gonna now throw this off his shoulders, make his hands nice and wide and place it nicely on the ground. So what he didn't do, and what's very important in this part, is his pistol hand is he does not want to twist his hands. If Bobby were to twist his hands, which he's gonna do right now, if you see what happened to that, your natural inclination is gonna be able to twist your hands when you go down, because it's a little uncomfortable. So just keep your hands exactly how they were when you put them off. He's gonna then set both the loads down. So if we look at what we have right now, it's kind of hard to see, but this is a V facing towards Bobby. At this point, all he needs to do is he's going to grab somewhere in the middle on this stack and somewhere in the middle on this stack and walk away from his drop point. Nice thing about this is it stretches out all that hose in a very small spot. And if we come back here, his coupling is here and his nozzle is here. I'll put them right next to each other and he can now call for water.